the most modern piano in the world today was developed in Paris. The design studio Peugeot Design Lab and the piano manufacturer Playel have created a piano that sets new standards both technically and visually. Cyril de Vaison Praden played a significant role in the project. He is both a designer and a pianist, and this modern piano is a childhood dream come true. The important thing about the project was not simply giving the piano a new style for no good reason. Because I myself play the piano, I really wanted to produce something special for pianists, something that would inspire them. I got my inspiration from when I was quite small. I stood on a stool to see what goes on inside a piano when you play it. I told myself that a piano for adults would have to be invented in which the mechanism is lowered so that you can look inside it while you're playing. And now I have a whole new feel in terms of acoustics. The sound comes back very straight and pure because there's no obstacle between the pianist and the strings. The development of the piano required months of research, studies and tests by designers, engineers and acousticians. The goal was to design something completely new, without losing sound quality, and to connect the traditional craftsmanship of piano making with the experience of the automotive industry. Car designers are accustomed to having their creativity severely limited by the demands of functionality. And this also applies to pianos with regard to the dimensions and the limitations of the frame, the mechanics, the keyboard and everything else. But we've created forms that are very new, very alternative. For everything to do with the mechanics and tone, we've stayed with the traditional materials. Only the outer shell, which gives the object its aesthetic appeal, is made of carbon fiber. The staff of Playel, the oldest piano manufacturer in the world, and the designers from Peugeot Design Lab worked together for two years. The technology of a piano does not allow total freedom of design. The most innovative new feature was the location of the action mechanics on a level with the keyboard. This enables the pianist to hear the sound more directly. The designers weren't aware until the very end whether they would really succeed in creating the piano of the future. The first time I saw the piano, it was uh, kind of nervous, kind of excited. It was like it's it's uh, it was two years after we we be we began building it, so it was it was just amazing to see that it was there. But it was also oh my god, is it really going to be as good as we thought it is? What's it going to sound like? It was lots of emotions. <laughs> This futuristic piano is produced in limited numbers. The design model can be had for 230,000 euros. The first orders have already been received. <laughs>